Phoebe? Yeah? Look at me. I'm like crap. I need a style upgrade. But you've got no money. I know. I've got it. Who needs money when you've got Wish.com? I feel like I need like a, a dapper suit. Let's see what we can find. God, there's way more options than I expected here. Which one do I go for? What about that one? What, this one here? Yeah. That's £40, I ain't got £40 to spare. I need the cheapest suit on Wish.com. Some of them, they look cheap. Like this one says it's like £17, but then when you select the size and colour you want, it just goes up to like 25 quid. Ha ha ha, I look sexy in that. <laughs> it's actually one of the cheaper ones as well. Do you think I'd look good in street hip hop suit role playing costume painted bright face suit suit male? I think we found it Phoebe, I think we found the cheapest one that's consistently the same sort of price, which is 15 quid, four pound delivery, that's a suit for 19 pound. The question is, what colour should I go for? I think that red one looks quite swish. Would I look like a millionaire in that one? We've got some great sizing options here. You can choose the whole suit in small, medium, large, or a variety of extra large sizes. <laughs> so, what do you think, medium? Yeah. Medium, in the red, let's buy it. This should arrive in about two to three weeks looking at that, which actually isn't terrible. It comes in with the promo code of love. It comes in at £18.25, that includes delivery. And it says here, high quality business and leisure suit. <laughs> the groom's best man wedding. I'm getting married, okay then. Let's go for it. Looks like we're in business. I didn't expect this to arrive this quick, to be honest. Normally when you think of like, wish.com, something like a month's wait. I didn't realize what it was at first because I didn't expect it to turn off. But then, so a glimpse, that beautiful burgundy suit. Do you reckon this is gonna look good? Shaking your head? Well, let's find out what a medium suit is gonna look like. Right, what have we got here then? Hmm. Well, it's very pinky red. Hmm. Fashion, my favorite brand, as expected. Feels a brilliant quality, but let's give it a try. Okay, you ready for me? The millionaire. <laughs> How many hundreds of thousands do I earn a week? <laughs> I didn't realize it's only got one button. Surprisingly, I think it fits slightly better than I expected, considering it was just a generic size medium, but it's come with an extra bonus feature. Whichever Chinese slave made these trousers, they've left the writing on, haven't they? Look, there's, there's like some chalk writing or some shit. What is this? That's, that's some Chinese symbol and then M611. What the hell is that? But you might be able to tell. It is wafer thin, whatever this is. What do you think? It's like a school uniform to me. A school uniform? <laughs> I guess uh, the trousers are a bit long, but amazingly, fits around the waist really well, actually. It fits just right, but unfortunately, it's the type of material that I honestly feel if I tugged, it would rip apart. As you'd expect, though, to be fair, for £18.25, I think it actually worked out as. It's not horrendously terrible. I guess what can you expect for that much money? Look at this too, you even get, you get your fake pocket square, pre-stitched in that you can't remove. Looking nice. You know what, I reckon I should go and change into like a, a shirt, because obviously I've got this on at the moment. Should I change into a shirt, see how it looks with that, see if it looks any better? Nice, nice. All I need to do is shave my head, Put some sunglasses on, and I'm Pitbull, you know what I'm talking about? No, I think it does look, I think it looks better with the, with the shirt on. There are obviously some telltale signs here that this is like 
super cheap aside from the really thin material. If you look at some of the stitching, like this area around the belt loop here, it's just a complete mess. <laughs> Same with a bit towards the bottom of the trousers, which are also definitely too long. The real question is, is it worth it? Well, I guess number one, the sort of claim from Wish.com that they offer uh, store quality goods, a uh, fraction of the price. That ain't exactly true. I think you'd honestly struggle to find a suit this bad uh, in any store, at least in the UK. But I suppose you can't really get a suit for 18 quid from anywhere apart from maybe a charity shop or a thrift store. Overall though, is it really worth having something this low quality? Probably not, unless it's a fancy dress. I suppose if I put some goofy teeth in and a wig, it's got like Austin Powers, can it? Wouldn't you say? <laughs> All right, so I've tested a suit off wish.com. Let me know in the comments section uh, how you rate this outfit. I'll try and get some close up shots of this one as well for you. What would you like me to buy next from wish.com? Maybe there's something else you want me to be the test dummy for, see if it's worth it. Maybe like a shaver or a watch or something. Also tell me down there too. But yeah, this is what suit you get for 18 quid and I'll see you in the next one.